Adam, you okay? Those drones... I'm fine. Whoever sent them didn't succeed. Oh, thank God for that. Listen, Janus just called. Versa Life is closing their account, moving everything out of that data vault tonight. This can't wait. You gotta get over there now. I can't. I found the bomb maker. She can tell us everything. But she's about to be killed. What? Shit, man, they're cleaning up Blue Sands. I can't break into a bank, not by myself. And if we don't do this now, we lose the Orchid. Fuck! But if I don't go to the Prokowska district, the bomb maker dies, and we're back to square one. Your call, man. What took you so long? You need to get in there. What is this place? This is where they're holding my daughter. After I evaded your agents, I followed one of those fanatics, and he led me here. Where is she? He said she was on one of the upper floors, but no one is allowed to go up there. These lunatics are armed. They'll shoot anyone who tries. Oh, what are they going to do to her? It's okay. Mr. Stanek, stay here. I'll take care of it. You're not going to the bank, are you? Like I said, the bomb maker. Can tell us everything, I know. But we're talking about a bioweapon, Adam. Once that vault is cleared out, whatever information was stored on the Orchid will be wiped clean. Gone. Yeah, I get it. Time is the enemy right now, Adam. I hope you reconsider. I hope you find this bomb maker, Adam, because I just watched a convoy of armored vans leaving the bank. Versa Life cleared everything out? Yep. We just lost the best chance we had to find out how to counter the Orchid. Who's here? What's going on out there? I told you I was not to be dist- Oh my. Come in. Come in and let me see you. How did you get in here? And how did you know to come now? Tonight of all nights, when we are finally ready to answer the call of the Machine God's infinite wisdom. Surely, your arrival here is not coincidental. I'm looking for Alison Stanek. <laughs> of course you are. And you have found her on the eve of her greatest achievement. But do you seek counsel? Assistance in your prayers or meditations? Or are you here to join us? To free yourself from this prison of flesh and give yourself to the glory of the singularity? If there is any way your High Priestess can be of assistance to you, I am more than happy to provide. I want to ask you about the bombs you built for the attack on Ruzika Station. Is that all? My augmented brother Victor is a brave man. And a great leader. When he asked me to build some of my little ones for him, I was proud to accept. I know Victor. If he's behind these attacks, I'd like to have a talk with him. After our flesh flood oppressors sent one of their dogs to murder Talos Racker, Victor moved his base of operations to a research center in the Swiss Alps. Garm, I believe it is called. Garm? Okay, I got it. That is why you came here? You entered this sacred place to solicit my help against Victor's holy revolution? Traitor! Blasphemer! And I believed you were one of us. I am. I just have a more inclusive idea of who us is. <laughs> then you have become their willing slave. But not I. I have felt the boots of the police, as they spat on me and mocked me for who I was. I could have lain down, like you, but I persevered, and the Machine God has given me my reward. I emerged from the Crucible, enlightened. Enlightenment is a state of elevated perception and wisdom. You seem to be a little short on both. If you were wrong about why I'm here, I bet you're wrong about a lot of other things, too. 
I admit, when you first arrived, I was in the middle of something, and that distracted me from the true reason for your visit. But who could have anticipated one such as you would side with our enemies? They steal from us, they rape and murder us. They are animals, and animals go extinct while technology perseveres. Victor is killing everyone, not just the abusers, but innocent people. People like your father, who's never been anything but supportive and forgiving. But father, such a sweet man. I can only hope Victor's attacks will continue to spare him. Continue? You mean there's gonna be more of them? Well, you don't think I built only three of my little ones for him, do you? I gave him enough to destroy the entire city. Now, if you will excuse me, I must get back to what I was doing before you came. Hey, we're not done here. Allison? Augmentations are the key. The consciousness is all. Cast off the bounds of flesh and blood. Embrace the singularity. Allison, stop. I know what you're doing. I've seen this kind of tech before. It ended badly. You are concerned with our lives. You do not need to worry, brother. Only this physical body will die. Our minds will depart our corporeal shells and merge with the infinite consciousness of the Machine God. This is the Ascension. I would invite you to come with us, but there is no more room. I'm more interested in preventing another attack. What's Victor's next target? I do not know, and it does not matter. I am on the threshold of a new existence. When I become one with the Machine God, the artificial burdens of this physical plane will no longer bother me. Of course they will. Your mind's made up of thoughts and memories. If that's the part of you moving on, you'll be taking all your rage and pain along with you. Good God. I... I had not thought of that. It seemed to me that this was my only chance. The world is made up of nothing but agony and suffering or the futile struggle to avoid them. Moments of happiness are quickly shattered by this reality. The Ascension is our only hope of deliverance. Not the only one. You've seen the worst that life has to offer, but you're still trying to make things better. And in spite of it all, you believe that it's possible. Everything you need is right here in this room. You are your best hope for deliverance. Brother, you... your faith in me... your beautiful trust... I am overcome. It cannot be coincidence that you have made yourself known to me on this most holy of occasions. You are a sign from the Machine God that I am to remain here a little while longer. I am not yet ready to ascend. I will spread wisdom to the rest of the world. My job in this world is to stop people like Victor, and I need your help to do that. Of course, my dear prophet. I am honored to assist you. Please, wait here. Take this. You can use it to defuse my little ones. It felt good for a change. To build something that saves lives instead of taking them. Agent Jensen? Over here. I am under arrest. People's lives were cut short, Allison. Because of bombs you made. None of my children will suffer for what I did. You have my word. When you confront Victor, be merciful. Remember, he is your brother. Right. Smiley, Stanek and her escorts are on the way back in now. I need to talk to Miller. Are you back yet? No, but just a sec. I'll get him on the line. 
Jensen. You and Pletcher find something? It's bigger than we thought. Where can I meet you? At Chicane's place. We're flying there now. Miller out. Alex, did Janus actually have a plan for this robbery? Or does he expect me to shoot my way to the vault? He had someone slip a package into the bank manager's car. Someone? It's parked in the employee parking garage. Let me know when you've got it. I'm glad you're doing this, Adam. Okay, Alex, I got the package. Now what? There's supposed to be a data rod and an access card inside, but the card is blank. Jaina said we need to imprint it with biometrics from an active account holder. So what? Kidnap somebody and steal their DNA? <sighs> Maybe next week. Tonight we can get what's needed from an office on the third floor. According to a contact, the bank keeps Klein's profiles on a secure terminal there. So all I gotta do is get through security to find it. Great. Where are you, Mr. Jensen? You said you were coming! I got caught up in something. I'll be there soon, Mr. Stanek. There is no more soon! You are too late! My little girl is gone! She's gone to their ascension! Mr. Stanek. Nomad. Ah, shit. Alex, you still with me? I'm accessing the biometric terminal now. How's this supposed to work? The way Janus explained it, malware on the card will look for the profile of an authorized Versalife representative and clone it. I thought he said the card was blank. Technically, I said it. Sorry. But the card should be active now. Find the elevator to the basement and try it. The access card worked, Alex. I'm in the elevator, heading down. Janus is good, man. He said security measures prevent wireless communications near the vault, so you and I will lose contact soon. Meaning I'll be on my own from here on in. Just until you enter the Versalife vault and plug the data rod into their terminal. Janus should be able to contact you directly once it's installed. He had me load a bunch of malware on it. Of course, you have to reach the vault access room and call down the Versalife vault first. If you're stopped by security... Just in case somehow you can hear me, I'm about to call down the Versalife vault, Alex. Janus, can you hear me? Yes. The link is weak, but I can strengthen it. Wait, what are you doing? The data rod contains a secret program. It's flagging everything it finds on Project Orchid and sending it to me. Wait, wait, that's an audio file. Can I hear it? Hello? Bob, it's Megan. Those Orchid samples you told my new assistant to send to Switzerland? I asked him not to bother you with that. It's okay. I told him he could. But it's just... I've never heard of this guard facility before. A recent acquisition. I'll have to take you there someday. That's not necessary. Listen, the changes we made to the Orchid's CAS enzymes, they're incredibly dangerous. Until we perfect the replacement-based fragment, GARM's researchers must keep a neutralizing enzyme on hand. I've read your reports, Megan. I know all about the failures of the CRISPR molecule. I'm even keeping a sample of the neutralizer inside a secure vault in case your research gets corrupted. You are? Trust me, you have nothing to worry about. Thank you. I just wanted to be sure this time. Good night, Bob. Good night, my dear. Megan. Dr. Reed, you seem disappointed. She joined Versalife shortly before Seraph Industries closed. I assumed you knew. I don't suppose you know anything about this facility in Switzerland. Garm, I've been digging into it ever since your ex said the name. It was a geological research center until 2025, when Bell Tower Associates bought it. They didn't list it on their balance sheet when they filed for bankruptcy. Yeah. I guess they also forgot to mention the spec ops unit that went AWOL. I have to get to Garm. What are you thinking? I'm thinking about the augmented mercs who ambushed us in Dubai. If Paige sent them the Orchid. That's everything. 
unless they're storing something physical in there. Either way, I suggest you leave soon. With the vault in that position, you should be able to exit through the shaft. Good luck, Mr. Jensen. And please don't forget the data rod when you leave. Janus, can you hear me? I think I found that neutralizing enzyme Megan and Paige were talking about. We don't have a lot of time, Mr. Jensen. We'll lose contact. No problem, I got this one. I might be able to save a life or two with this, if the orchid shows up again. Miller, it's Jensen. Yeah. I've got a lead on the augmented mercs who ambushed us in Dubai. You're supposed to be investigating the train station attack. Just hear me out. There's a research facility. Not like this, you don't. I'm en route to Prague now. She'll be landing at Chicane's helipad any minute. I'll hear you out there. Miller out. Adam, it's Delara. I managed to find out some information on that Marchenko guy you asked me to look into. What'd you get? Well, for starters, he wasn't always Victor Marchenko. He... Ah! Shit. I have to go.